it really matters because what we're trying to do is avoid greenwash. We're trying to make sure that what we track and what we report is based on robust definitions so that our own shareholders and other parties can really trust that when we say we're financing climate mitigation, we're really actually financing projects that help keep us well below two degrees, which is what we want to support the Paris Agreement. Climate finance tracking at the bank is the way that we uh, record uh, what climate finance we're doing and so that we can show people that we're really financing uh, important mitigation and adaptation actions. And on top of that, of course, some of those projects go into our green bonds and investors in our climate awareness bonds as well want to be really sure that what they're investing in is based on a robust system and that is based on our tracking. EIB has been very active. We, in fact, coordinated the MDB group two years ago. We've been working very closely on a number of aspects. Um, and in fact, next year, we will be taking forward with the other MDBs the work on mitigation, like renewable energy and, and so on. And so that really is the bank at the forefront of this kind of methodological work, uh, which is a good counterbalance to the fact that we also, of course, are at the front from a volume point of view. So the two go hand in hand.